More team coverage of the blustery conditions overnight right now. As Gil just told us, a wind advisory remains in place for Wyndham, Tolland, and Hartford counties until 5 o'clock this evening. And Bradley International Airport has been dealing with major gusts up to 58 miles per hour. That's where we find News 8's Noelle Gardner. She is there. She saw some damage on the way up there. She's layered up again. Good morning, Noelle. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Yeah, I'm sick of these layers and driving here. It was a tough commute this morning. I'm at Bradley International Airport, and I just went inside to check for you guys. There are no cancellations, no delays, so that is some good news, but give you... Give yourself some extra time getting here this morning. Now, I did check with CLMP. There are a number, hundreds of outages this morning, over 1,500 outages in Madison, East Haddam, um, East Hartford, as well as Ledger and uh, Norwalk. So you want to look out for those. Uh, crews are out there. They are repairing those outages. Now, if you do see a down power line, police say don't even get near it. Let's take a listen. A down tree is a dangerous situation. Uh, call and report it as soon as possible. And you're looking at video this morning. A tree coming down last night on Caleb Street. Police had to close Farmington Avenue for more than an hour there. Traffic was at a standstill after a tree trunk blocked the traffic. And last night, more than 1,600 people were without power. Please say if you run across a down power line or anything that looks out of the ordinary, of course, stay away. And also, video, if we can show that uh, last night, a man driving his truck in Torrington, a tree coming down, smashing the cab and landing on the bed of the truck. Please say he is lucky to be alive. He wasn't injured. That's also some very good news this morning. I am live outside Bradley International Airport. I'll send it back to you guys in the studio.